Today we are installing the SC Sport 400 on a contender with twin 250 Mercury's. First thing you want to do is remove the trim cover, the top piece. There's a little lip that's going to slide forward. So with the rubbing alcohol, you want to clean real good where the disc grips are going to go. So the most important part to be clean is the, is the bottom of the, uh, the cavitation plate on both sides and then it also grips on the on the top sides as well. Once you determine the proper position for the disc grips, some of the packages will include a blue sticky, your package may have a red sticky, and these are going to go right on top of the cavitation plate right above where the disc grips go. And that's going to stick to the uh, to the top of the foil. And then of course before uh, before you're ready to, to uh, put the hydrofoil on, go ahead and remove the 3M. It'll, it may, it'll either be 3M paper or just regular plain paper. There are two sizes of bolts. The longer ones are for the aft end, the wider end of the hydrofoil. On the aft end you get to use the long ones and the short ones are for the, uh, the forward end. Line up the hole, drop it straight in. See how there's a little lip that's raised up? So you're going to turn the top of the bolt until it drops straight down in flush with the top of the dewasher. Slide the disc grip up through the hole, hold the top of the bolt with your finger, slide the, uh, the large washer on first, now here's the, uh, the smaller washer, and then last is the lock nut. Of course the, uh, the rounded part of the lock nut goes on the bottom, so just tighten it up. Finger tight, you'll feel the plastic lock threads get secure. So after you get all four disc grips on, we're going to tighten them up in an alternating pattern and uh, we want to tighten these down very snug. And as you're, as you're tightening, you'll start to see the rubber of the disc grip compress. That's what you want. You want, the, you want the rubber to compress and even squeeze out a little bit from the cavitation plate, uh, even up to an eighth of an inch because that's, that's what's going to hold it secure. So you can tighten it down snug and then we'll come back and do a little bit more tightening after we uh, tighten it in a uh, in an equal uh, equal manner. So they're squeezed out nice right there. Squeezed out nice there. After you finish, give it a tug. That's not going anywhere. That is rock solid. Trim plate, Phillips screwdriver, stainless uh, Phillips screw. You want to slide the trim plate all the way forward. So you're pushing down and sliding aft at the same time. Pushing down, sliding aft. Phillips screw, just line it up. That's it, very simple, about a 10 minute installation. Rock solid fit. One more to go, five to 10 minutes and we're off boating. Hope you enjoy.